Oh, we're back to CapCut. Let me show this block glitch transition. We'll place both of our clips as usual in the same video channel. By default, you have a simple jump cut. And here we want to place this glitch transition. So we go to transitions, open a drop down, and there is currently a glitch category. You should find the blocks right here. If you can't, just type it into the search bar above. Download it, and when you apply it first using the plus sign, you might get this warning message. Simply confirm. It means that a couple of frames need to be duplicated. I actually want to make this way longer than the default. At around 1.5 seconds, I'm fine with this. If you want to adjust the duration, just make sure that you've got this element selected in the timeline. Hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.